uh, there is quick news coming through for uh, Vincent Abubakar. He says, the World Cup is a beautiful and emotional competition. We are in a tough group against the likes of Brazil, Switzerland and Serbia. We won't be afraid of Brazil because the, current, because the current side is not the Brazil of old. It is true that they have some quality players, but you need, you need a United squad to go far in the tournament. A team with big names, but no unity means nothing. That is Vincent Abubakar on recently speaking about his country's chances in the group in which they face Brazil, Switzerland, and Serbia. Tough group. So this is the group then. Brazil, Serbia, Switzerland, Cameroon. Cameroon's first game is against Switzerland, and then they will play Serbia, then they wrap up with Brazil. Yeah, the Swiss are preparing very well, and mind you, on the 17th of November, they play Ghana because they feel... Yes, maybe physically Cameroon a little bit percentage-wise, a bit more stronger. Yeah. But they think Ghana's play, Cameroon's play Similar. would give them, yeah, on the 17th. Yeah. And after that, they play uh, Cameroon, Cameroon yeah. in their first game. Yeah. And, you know, that so, is a good test good, for good. Switzerland. But what do you make of the statement that Vincent Abubakar says right there? Spot on. I mean, if you listen to uh, Stephen Tornado Apia, you know, one of the things that made him a good, or I will say great captain, was that he allowed the other players to feel um, part of the team. He, he was a leader, but he allowed others who had leadership qualities to also flourish. You know, he had seniors like Sami Kufo and the rest uh, around him who he respected and allowed to play that role. And I think in a team, you need that unity where mm -hmm. a captain or the coach plays a role of making sure everybody feels that they are contributing to the team. Mm -hmm. If you have factions, you have divisions and you have issues where players are not really in that, you know, the vibe isn't right, it will affect your play on the pitch. So I think it's, it's, it's in the right direction, what he said. We'll be wishing yeah. to keep an eye on Cameroon and wishing them all the best in that difficult group where they've come up against Brazil, Switzerland and Serbia. Qatar 2022 FIFA World Cup Finals. Welcome to the big countdown.